we're rolling. Yeah, or like a selfie stick. But I'm not gonna get a selfie stick. There's no way out. Welcome to the M Cube channel. I am trying to upload more content on this channel. This vlog is gonna be about Vancouver talk videos that actually went pretty much viral. Not viral, viral in terms of like the M Square channel. I went from 200 views to 17,000 views in about a month. So we're gonna discuss it. The topic for that video was racial preference when dating. Okay. Why do you pick a certain type of race when you're dating and want to try a relationship with? I'm gonna start with myself here. I prefer when it comes to dating Asians. Why I prefer Asians? Ugh. Like I don't have a cultural clash with them. My parents are from mainland China. If they see an Asian, they feel more comfortable I think. I just like Asians more. I grew up with Asians. Not that I weeded out Caucasians or all the other races. I meet a girl that click with her and then yeah, you know, I would give it a goal, right? What about you Oliver? I don't know, I've never had like one specific problem. Personally, I've dated across the board like Asian, Caucasian, East Indian, but I do lean towards Asian as well. Have you dated more Asians? Mm, I've definitely dated more Asians as than well. Like, yeah, yeah. You, you did it half first, right? Yeah, that too. My arm's getting really tired. <laughs> Holy sh! I don't know how people do this. It's crazy. Yeah, anyways, continue. Sorry. Sorry. I was always very comfortable around them. I guess my own personality sometimes matches them. Okay, let's just well, say appearance-wise, are they actually better looking? Then, like, you can't, it's, that's, that's like a preference, well, that's right? preference, like, I don't think you can objectively say, like, one race looks better, better than the other. No. Because, like, they have different features, and I guess I'm more drawn to Asian features. I personally find them more attractive, but that doesn't mean they're objectively more attractive, right? When you were growing up in Vancouver, like, we both grew up in Vancouver, were you surrounded by more Asians than, per se? <laughs> when I was, like, really young, from when I was born till about eight to nine years old, we lived in a place called Surrey, up in outside of... Vancouver, and I was just surrounded by East Indians most of the time. Really? 90% of my classmates were East Indians. Stop playing like, the strap, dude. You're moving the camera, man. <laughs> my neighbors as well. And then when I moved to Vancouver, around 10 ish, then I was surrounded by Asians more. Yeah, so I guess it plays a bit of a, a part. part of it, right? like, I was never really surrounded by ca Caucasians a lot. Maybe when I went back to Europe um, to visit family. Mm. Like, then I was surrounded by Caucasians a lot, but that was for like short periods of time each mm. year. Mm. It has something to do with it. I've seen an East Indian girl, like, she's cute. Like, I'd be attracted to her. Yeah, for sure. I haven't really gone to talk to her. It's kind of bad at me to think that I have more things in common with the Oriental. It makes sense. You culture. grow up in like yeah, the same. Exactly. Exactly. Way, right? I, so, I, I assume that, but that's not always the case, right? There's true. so much mixing in between. You have Caucasians loved in the Asian culture, going to Asia, speaking the language, the food, all the nuances and everything. They're more Asian than I would ever, ever be. And like, I've been to like anime conventions too. Different mixes of people. So many white people. Oh yeah, way more Asian than I would. Like, they would name all the anime stuff. And like, does that make you Asian? Really? Does that make you know. a fan of the culture? I mean, you find, yeah. But does that make you? Like, does it make you who you know. are? Not really. I guess the things you enjoy, what you're into, does kind of make you who you are. Like, they're all a part of who we are, so it's difficult to say. Yeah, that's the thing. It's it's a personal preference. You know, whatever you prefer. Who am I to say that, you know, you can't have that? Or you can't go for that? You shouldn't surround yourself with that preference that you want. I'm gonna end it there. What do you people think? Comment below. Tell us your preferences. Yeah, tell us your preferences. Keep watching this channel. Show us subscribe. I'll pop Oliver's Instagram up there. Not to kill each other in the comments. Yes, try not to murder each other in the comments. Like, I shouldn't say that word, actually. Try not to, like, step on each other in the comments. There you go. I don't know if I say M Square out or like M Cube out. I'm not too sure yet. If you go to the M Square channel, I'm gonna leave a link in the description below. Racial preference video, then go talk to you. There's a lot of comments, and a lot of them was like hate on each other, hate on each other's race and stuff like that. Don't do that. Like have a you know an intelligent discussion like we're doing right now, right? My arm is tired, so this video is ending. <laughs>